Oh, okay. This reading is Sagittarius. I already pre-shuffled my cards, but I'll do them again. Again, these are my storytelling decks. So if you guys want to book a personal, um, I think I'm gonna make this about $50. I'm just starting out. Let's see what the story is. Let's see. It may not resonate with everyone, so don't even tell me. But okay, starting off. Most of my storytelling cards are like secrets being revealed in relationships. Okay, so starting off Sagittarius, you have the Ten of Cups in the reverse. Okay, could be dealing with a happy. Uh, oh, whoa, shit. Okay, could be dealing with a situation with um a child, yep, child's parent or something like that. Could be a Libra, but it's not really a good situation right now. You know what I mean? Nothing is coming from this. Sagittarius are not really my people. There's definitely a queen of swords who's pissed off, okay? She's not happy about this love situation, this home, this family situation. Could be the, um, the mother of your child. You guys hopefully aren't going to the court systems, but could be that. Whoever this air sign is, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Sagittarius, not too happy with you. Not at all. Not at all. But this is about you. Well, Sag. You seem to be pretty okay. So if this is a couple, if I just had to say the Empress and the Emperor, Sagittarius are known to not give a fuck. So if you, if this situation is big and it's like a home situation, dealing with like a Libra, or another air sign, you you're not you're not giving any energy to it. You know, you guys' egos are so big, it's crazy. Yeah, you're not giving anything to it. You're like whatever. It is what it is. It'll work. It'll work. Yep. Pass. With the pass. If it work, if it work. Um, I don't think you want to move forward. I think you're contemplating about moving forward. But if you have to, King of Wands, your suit, Aries, Sag, Leo, you really wouldn't give a fuck. You probably could have found out that your spouse, because this is like really talking about. Okay. You could have found out that your spouse is given to other suitors, okay? This could definitely be the baby mom who found out that you, Sag, were given to other people. But I'm going to say I think that's what the secret is. You guys both may have been juggling a situation, okay? Um, Right now, it's not happy. You know, it's no celebration. Oh, God, Sagittarius, please don't be out here fucking with Virgo's heart, okay? I really don't have the time. But whatever it is that you're doing, Sag, I know you're not putting any energy into it. You're not. But just like Virgo, Sagittarius, you guys don't walk away from shit either, okay? You guys will stay for so long because secrets. Sag, you out here cheating again? Yeah, out here cheating again? Okay. You guys will stay in this uh, commitment just because, like, the ego in you is like, I know you would never find anyone better, okay? If you're dealing with a Libra and you're a Sagittarius, I'm being 100% honest, um, Sagittarius, they always win a the war. They always win a the war. They always win a the war. Sagittarius, you guys, y'all know, I can't even, my Sagi game, I can't even lie, y'all know y'all be out here com offering everything juggling relationships y'all never end shit though y'all never end shit though yeah it may end with the past but i doubt it i doubt it but i know you're holding back from this person whoever you in a relationship with yep holding back from this commitment i know that you're not even stressed about it though Sash. that's the thing like y'all don't care y'all don't be in your heads y'all don't let it stress you out i mean i, I really i know so many couples that are like libras and sagittarius and i just have to admit the Sag always win. Because Sagas are just naturally people who don't give a fuck. And I love that about them. They don't care. Like, they don't allow love to affect them. But here's the thing. Sag with you is given. It can go either way. You still going to do you. You still going to offer and do it. It can go either way. You definitely could be dealing with a Virgo. Capricorn Taurus. But it ain't no... This whoever this other person is, whoever is at home, the mom in the situation, the woman, I would say, not happy. 
don't have any balance with your ex. They, they, they're not happy. It doesn't matter. You know what I'm saying? They're probably feeling stuck. Yep. Feeling stuck. They don't feel stable. You're out here doing whatever the hell you want to do, Sagittarius. You know what I mean? They don't know which way they should go. But that's the thing about Sagittarius, too. They're not like an air sign. Like, God forbid, you get a Sag with, like, a rising air or something like that. But Sagittarius, they fuck your head up with, you would think, mind games. But just their actions. It's not really mind games. You're not spying. If anything, the other person is lurking on you. Right now, here's the truth of it all. It's not a happy situation, you know what I mean? There's no love. No one is really offering the other a new start. Um, The person, whoever you're dealing with, is so confused. They they really don't know if they should work on it or if they should leave. But I know it's toxic. I know your ass out here offering, <laughs> oh my God, don't let this be somebody with money. Because the worst thing, like... The worst thing for a Sag to have is money, okay? Is money. They are crazy. Secrets, lies, being deceitful. It may be information coming out about your moves. I don't think this is funny it's for whoever the spouse is, but when you just truly know a Sagittarius, you know. You, Sag, you may have fucked around. Please don't tell me you got another family out here. Please don't tell me, because if this person found out that it's a kid somewhere in this situation, they up all night, like, they so messed up in their head. They're so messed up. They're so messed up. They don't know if they should move on. And I think because it may be a situation about another commitment elsewhere in a family, that's what's making them move on, okay? Because I don't know what Sagittarius do to Libras, but y'all be swinging because it ain't no way. Libra stay too goddamn long with Sagittarius. And y'all don't ever leave evil off the strength of you're going to do what, you're wanna, what you want to do. Okay? This person may be trying to manifest a new start and stand their ground, but let's see how long that's going to last. They ain't going to have victory in it. They're going to come right back to your ass because you are their wish fulfillment. Sagittarius, oh God. Yep, I know they spying on you. I know they are. I know they spying on you, but guess what you're doing? Still out here. Offering love to any and everything you want to do. You don't give a damn. You don't give a damn. You ain't waiting on shit. Nothing is holding you back. And I tell people all the time, you not offering love. Okay, I think my story is ending, okay? Um, yeah, there's definitely a mistress somewhere. There's a third party in here, okay? It's a mistress. Yeah, whatever the truth came out about this mistress, if it's a baby or something that's been hidden or lied to, understand this. That is what got your partner. Yeah, truth came out. Mm-hmm, truth came out about what? Mm-hmm, somebody feeling betrayed. Your ass out here acting single. Oh, goodness gracious, Sagittarius. Jesus, y'all are the ones. Keep it up with other fire signs, no Sagittarius, they're the ones. That's the clarity that came out. And this fire sign, I mean, not even if I, it could be with another fire sign, but if it's you as a Sagittarius woman, you could have found out about this. But if it's a Sag man, which I very well believe it's a Sag man, mm -hmm, doing what he does, yeah, that may be what a new kid in this situation may be what broke you guys up, okay? Definitely a lot of conflict. Somebody got a kid, yeah. Whoever this per yep, found out about options. Whoever this person is, stuck and they found out about options. Yep. Whoever this person is that you're with, um, definitely feel they they so fucked up in the head right now. I'm sorry, baby. Because let me ask you if Sag care. Do Sag even give a fuck? No. And it's not that Sages don't love you. They just don't let situations like that stress them out for too long. Yeah. Uh, again, Sag, I don't think you care if you're in this commitment or not. In the past, it could have had you in your head. You've kind of been... I just see you focus on your money. I see you focus on your money. You kind of just been like, it's a whatever situation. All right, Sages, stop doing these people out here like that. Because I, I know it's not you being dumb like that. It's, if it's a female, it could be you being dumb like that. But if it's a man, I'm telling you.
Please stop being sneaky, okay? Stop breaking this person's heart. Please stop, because it's this person is, oh my gosh, is this person even feel attractive, I swear. Oh, you keep bringing drama to the table. Yeah, got this person feeling all types of sick. All types of sick. I keep saying all right, but yeah. Um, Be honest, you know what I'm saying? If you feel like the situation is best to walk away from, do it. I don't really think you are. You know what I'm saying? I really don't think you are. Because over time, Sag just always has this nonchalant attitude that over time, a new start is going to begin anyway. You know, that person may still be guarded, but that's your mentality. Your mentality is, girl, all right, whatever. You love me or you don't. We getting back together or we not. Come out of feeling all crazy and stuff. You still gonna have mistresses. It doesn't matter. You're still gonna have a side. You're not gonna ever stop moving away. You move. All right. Cause if you, yeah, yeah. All right. That's it. Yeah. And that's what the truth is. The truth is, you're always still gonna have bitches on the side. You're still gonna do you. And it probably won't be no new start. Okay. All right.